Yeah, on the monitor. Something's wrong. It's reacting to outside stimuli, showing an awareness of his surroundings. Oh my God, Miranda, I think he's waking up. Damn it, Wilson, he's not ready yet. Give him the sedative. Shepard, don't try to move. Just lie still. Try to stay calm. Heart rate's still climbing. Brain activity is off the charts. Stats pushing into the red zone. It's not working. Another dot. Now. Heart rate dropping. Stats falling back into normal range. That was too close. We almost lost him. I told you your estimates were off. Run the numbers again. pistol doesn't have a thermal clip. It's a med. Can you head down, ship? Shield yourself from the blast. Someone's hacking security trying to kill you. Look for a thermal clip for your pistol. Looks like they set up a barricade to try holding the mechs off. Look out! <laughs> Keep moving, we need to get to the shuttles. All right, well, looks like here we, uh, this is part three, the actual first combat that we've had in the game. Everything looks pretty good so far. Combat does feel uh, a lot better than uh, Mass Effect 1, that's for sure. Uh, the power wheel still uses the same way, except now you can map buttons. Makes things a lot easier. That we don't always have to pause the combat, but... Uh, that was cool. Obviously you can tell I just played this game for the first time right now, so... Very cool new abilities and uh, combat's very, uh, it's more, sh you know, it's everything actually counts, headshots matter, things count, you know, it's, it's, it's not just be in the area, it's, you know, where you aim, it's directional damage, which, you know, is like any other shooter out there, so it's definitely a lot better than... game definitely feels a lot like kind of gears as far as the cover system goes, so that's pretty cool. Take the elevator down one floor. Definitely feels a lot better in your hands. That's what she said. Oh, I went there. Hurry, get to the door. Run. No longer do you have a uh, sprint mechanic. It looks like it's just pretty much just like gears. you listen to as much as possible without me interrupting it. Mark update. The cost of this project is astronomical. Over four billion credits so far. But nobody seems to care that we've gone over budget. I don't know where the boss gets all his money. Maybe it's better not to know. I just wish he'd get a little more in my direction once in a while. 
definitely uh, show how sucky I am at this uh, new hacking game, which there are two new mini hacking games. This is the first one where it's like you match up the codes, uh, you try to match them up in line. And then the other one is more of a text-based game where you try to max up the text, which you'll see in a little bit. But uh, they're a welcome addition to just the uh, random button matching that you would do in the first Mass Effect. And no longer do you gain experience from killing just enemies. Experience is gained on a mission-based level. And if you import your saves, you get a lot of credits. All that extra stuff. Definitely went all out for this one, huh? Shepard, Looks like here we meet your first uh, crew member, Jacob, and uh, he's a pretty interesting character. Let's take a look. What are you doing here? I thought you were still a work in progress. Are you with Miranda? Yeah. Sorry, I forgot this is all new to you right now. I'm Jacob Taylor. I've been stationed here for hostiles detected. Damn it! Things must be worse than I thought if Miranda's got you running around. I'll fill you in, but we better get you to the shuttle first. I know this isn't the best time, but I'm sick of stumbling around when I don't know what's going on. Fair enough. I'll give you the quick version. You and your ship were attacked and destroyed. You were killed, dead as dead can be when they brought you here. Our scientists spent the last two years putting you back together. You've been comatose, or worse, that whole time. Welcome back to your life. This doesn't look like an Alliance facility. It is. I can't say much more than that for now. The Alliance officially declared you killed in action. The whole galaxy thinks you're dead. And if we don't get to those shuttles, they'll be right. Were there any other survivors from the Normandy? I'll tell you what. You help me finish off these mechs, and I'll play 20 questions with you all day. We're low on thermal clips, but I'm a biotic. Just give the order when you want me to hit them with the good stuff. Well, uh, we're gonna look at some new powers here and see how they work. This will be uh, the final part of the commentary for this video as the rest of the scene is a cutscene. So um, I hope you enjoy this and please comment, rate, subscribe and enjoy the rest of the videos. I will have more up shortly. Okay. I promised I'd answer your questions. What do you want to know? You said they spent two years rebuilding me? How bad were my injuries? I'm no doctor, but it was bad. When I first saw you, you were nothing but meat and tubes. Anywhere else, they'd have put you in a coffin. But Project Lazarus was different. Cutting-edge technology. What do you mean? Cloning? Cybernetics? I don't know the details. You'd have to ask the scientists. But I'm pretty sure you're not a clone. They wanted to bring you back exactly as you were. You're still you. You just might have a few extra bits and pieces now. What can you tell me about the project? Were there other test subjects? Project Lazarus only had one subject. The whole point was to bring you back. Just you. Even that was a challenge. Two years. All the top scientists. The best technology money could buy. Do you know anything about this attack? Who's behind it? What they're after? Damn if I know. I was getting ready for some shut-eye, then BAM! Bunch of explosions. Next thing I know, every damn mech in the place starts shooting at us. I'm guessing it had to be an inside job. You'd need top security access to hack all the mechs. You said they spent two years rebuilding me? How bad were my injuries? I'm no doctor, but it, anywhere else they'd have put you in a coffin. But Project Lazarus was different. Cutting edge technology. The last thing I remember is the Normandy blowing up. Did anyone else make it? Just about everybody survived. A few servicemen from the lower decks didn't get out. Navigator Presley was killed by an explosion. But everyone else, including the non-alliance crew, the Asari, Liara, and the Quarian, they all made it out alive. Do you know what any of them are doing now? I don't know, Commander. It's been two years. They've moved on. Left the Alliance. Could be anywhere. What's the quickest way to those shuttles? Depends where the mechs are thickest. It's probably best if check, you... Check, check. Anyone on this frequency? 
Anybody still alive out there? Hello? Wilson, this is Jacob. I'm here with Commander Shepard. Just took out a wave of mechs over in D-Wing. Shepard's alive? How the hell? Never mind. You need to get him out of there. Get to the service tunnels and head for the network control room. Roger that, Wilson. Stay on this frequency. I think I remember a Wilson checking on me one time when I woke up. That's him. He's the chief medical tech. Answers directly to Miranda. Come on. The service tunnels are this way. 